tell us about your character in uh, in Twilight. Um, I play Jacob Black. He is a Native American, part of the Quileute tribe. He's just a really, you know, happy-go-lucky, friendly guy, easy to relate to, and uh, he's a family friend of Bella uh, the Swans, and uh, he has a pretty big crush on Bella. So. Okay. Yeah. So you got that whole storyline going. Yep, yep. You got the underlying story of uh, Jacob's crush on Bella. So. So you're not a vampire in this one. I'm not a vampire in Twilight. I am just a normal human. Just a it's regular, rare. just a regular dude. Yep. So far, <laughs> later on in the series, he turns into a werewolf. Um, in New Moon and Eclipse, you know. But uh, we'll see. That 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 would be interesting. <laughs> you read those books? Though? Yeah, I have. Yeah, you like them? yeah, when I did Twilight, I wanted to focus just on Twilight, so I read the first book. And then right when I got done, um, I cranked out the second and third because char uh, Jacob's character is so much different from the first and the second and third because in the first, he's just this really, you know, happy, normal human guy. And in the second one, when he transforms, he becomes this fierce, angry, grumpy character. What does that turn then? What, what is it that, that makes him turn into? It's, it's, oh, um, well, there's a myth that it skips every generation, so my father in the Quileute tribe, so my father will not, he's not a werewolf, um, but me and my grandfather, and not my kid, but my grandson would be a werewolf when we turn uh, the age of 16 or when we hit puberty. So um, when, uh, is there any talk of a sequel? I mean, I know it's pretty early, but. No, no decisions have been made yet, but uh, we'll see, that would definitely be cool. How cool would that be to be a, be a werewolf? That would be cool. <laughs> so we'll see, keep our fingers crossed. <laughs> <laughs> um, the vampires in this movie are, they're not your typical vampire. Definitely not. You know, they're not the crazy Dracula, yeah, <sighs> let me suck your blood. But um, that's what I think makes this story so much different is uh, it's a romance. It's a romance about a girl falling in love with a vampire. And the vampire aspect of it is what brings the action and stuff, you know. Uh, you got the uh, the cool thing about the film is it has a little bit of something for everyone. It has the romance. It has tons of action. It's a thriller, and uh, it's you know it's a horror. So it's gonna be cool. Everyone's gonna love it. How do you like Comic Con so far? It's cool. You know, I've definitely I've just been walking this line. Uh, I just got here a couple minutes ago, but uh, I'm excited to get downstairs and see the big hall with 6,000 fans waiting. It'll it's be nuts. It's nuts stuff. That's what I hear. So we'll see. Everyone dressing up in costumes. It's really just I know. I was thing. on the highway and uh, looked outside of my window, and there was a person with a Spider-Man face, and then like Iron Man was right next to her, and yeah. I was like, what? <laughs> All right. Thanks a lot, man. Nice meeting you. All right. We're here with uh, uh, Stephanie Meyer. You wrote uh, Twilight, and um, Catherine uh, Hardwick directed. Um, these aren't your typical vampires, which you know they don't fangs you know that that kind of whole gory thing so uh you know what was the inspiration for that when writing it i'm not uh i don't read vampire books i don't watch vampire movies i'm really not into horror so i didn't know the rules it makes it very easy to break them i just wrote what i wanted to see what i would want to read and and so it ends up not feeling like a vampire novel at all what is it about stephanie's books that i have to make that movie well um you know, when she says it doesn't feel like a vampire movie, that's true, but in another way, vampires are like the sexiest of all the supernatural creatures and seductive, and that's what Stephanie wrote, like really sexy vampires. So I like that. You know, I wanted to really feel that heat, that passion, that romance, and the danger that she put into her book. But I also really loved how she took you right inside this teenage girl's heart, and you felt like you were 17 again, falling in love for the first time. Loved it. I was hooked. <laughs> um, uh, as a as an author of the book, had had you gotten offers before? Um, actually, and the, maybe you waited out for it, or we actually had it optioned with another company before, and it had a close call experience with a really terrible script. Um, so we were careful when we went with Summit, and they really wanted to do it the right way, and they're willing to guarantee us that. So it was it was a good fit for Twilight. It really was.